Fils qui vous naît. Fils qui vous naît. Fils. Alright, look. Hit that like button. Hit that sub button. And you hit that notification bell. You understand me? Subscribe to my channel. Join this Fisk Unit Army and get Fisk Unit tough. Now listen. The Washington Cockroaches is at it again. This, this, this bottom of the barrel, good for nothing, worthless franchise is up to its antics again. So now they're contacting Andrew Luck, who is property of the Indianapolis Colts because he retired in the middle of a contract. Shout out to Who That Nation. Shout out to all my Saints people out there. This is why Denver had to trade for Sean Payton. Even though Sean Payton was retired because he had a contract with the Saints, he had to be traded for because he was still property of the New Orleans Saints. So I'm trying to understand why the Washington Cockroaches are out here tampering with the property of other franchises. Oh, wait, let me let me let me, let me refresh my memory. Their owner was Daniel Snyder. OK, the Teflon Don of the NFL. Now, granted, I know he's selling the team to the, the to the Philadelphia 76 owner, but let's keep it a bean right now. I don't watch the Donald Sterling's had to sell the team. The uh, Phoenix Suns owner sold his team a couple months ago. The owner of the Panthers had to sell his team. I didn't see owners have to sell their team for less than what this dude been accused of. This dude been accused of prostituting his own cheerleaders, um, freaking uh, sexual harassment type stuff in the workplace, all kind of stuff, bro. And he still keeps the team. It's a freaking amazing to me how he gets away with this. But at the end of the day, shout out to Jim Ursay for issuing a warning. Do not talk to Andrew Luck without permission. That's tampering. And you need to be investigated and you need to be prosecuted to the fullest extent of the NFL law. Bottom line, because at the end of the day, all you have to do is ask. You have to get a spanking from your parents when you were a kid because you, you, you basically you put your hand in a cookie jar without permission or you know what I'm saying you went and you got a piece of cake or you grabbed some fruit snacks and a Capri Sun at the dinner without asking and you got a little spanking because you should have asked for permission well that's basically what the cockroaches did I'm pretty sure the Colts who just drafted Anthony Richardson or better yet this happened a year ago this happened last offseason I'm 99 percent sure the Colts after trading for Carson Wentz I'm sure they weren't thinking about um what's his what's his face Andrew Luck, and I'm 33. Me and Andrew Luck are a month apart. I was born in August of '89. He was born in September '89. I promise you, he ain't taking them hits. Andrew Luck is not trying to take them hits. I hurt my back at the gym a month ago and I'm still sore. Okay, when you in your 30s, your body is different. I be hurting. Okay. Andrew Luck ain't trying to take them hits no more. That's why he retired in the first place. You think he about to go back to the NFL and go against Kayvon Thibodeau? Go against Makai Parsons? Go against that, 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 that crap in Philly, them monsters they got on their defensive line? The, the Georgia dope dudes they got over there? Come on, bro. Andrew Luck ain't coming out of retirement to play for y'all. Washington, you're not relevant. I'm a Giants fan. Okay, when I beef, I beef with Eagle fans. I beef with Cowboy fans. Y'all not relevant. I only beef with y'all because I'm petty and I send shots everywhere. When I spray the block, Fist Vegas spray the block. Everybody going to get it. So because I happen to be on the block with an ugly abandoned buildings like Marlowe on the wire, you know what I'm saying? Everybody else got nice town homes. Everybody else got uh, two car driveways. Y'all in a shack look like a third round cut, look a third world country. Y'all going to get the bullets too, though. But at the end of the day, Washington, y'all are at the kitty table. A lead of grown folk conversations to Giants fans, to Eagle fans, to Cowboy fans. Y'all are at the kitty table. Okay? And if you keep running your mouth, I'm going to put you outside with the dogs. All right, Washington? Know your role. Shut your mouth and stop tampering with other teams. That's it. That's all. Subscribe to the unit if you're rocking with me. My name is Fist Vegas, and I approve this message.